Hi everyone, it is Holly and Kayla with Never Quite Perfect. Today we have two teas from August Uncommon that we will be trying. The first one is Breathless. This is Boozy Black Tea, White Chocolate and Prune. Tastes like Armagnac, Prune, Dark Cherry and Whipped Cream. Feels like the French New Wave. Ingredients, Indian Assam black tea, hazelnut brittle, sweet blackberry leaf, white chocolate, dried plum, and flavoring. She's falling. And I've decided to try some more of their tea since I love their Psycho candy so much. I say it's Fisco candy, but that's just... There is what it looks like. It looks kind of glittery. It's glittery? Interesting. Mm -hmm. Gonna give it a try? We have creamer here, too. Is there an apple in that? No. Ooh. It's good. Ozzy. This one is good. All right, let's try it with a little bit of creamer. We must be precise to the amount we put in. I try to be, but sometimes. Then there's me over here like, oh, that's enough. Sometimes we want a little way too much. Like the tea's turning white. <laughs> I'm definitely getting the plum. Yes, definitely plum. Prune, plum, whatever. This is actually pretty good. <laughs> um, my rating. I'm going to say three and a half. I'm going to go with that three and a half also. It's pretty good. I don't know that it's good enough to order again. I mean, I like it. There should be enough in here to try ice. We'll try it ice. Okay. Next up is Metropolitan. And... Ew, maybe your troll's hair is wearing my mouth. <laughs> Here's what that one looks like. This one says, Vibrant Black Tea with Bergamot, Plum, and Clove. Tastes like bitter orange zest, neroli flower, tart black plum, blackberry clove. Feels like sparkling conversation on a city terrace. Ingredients, Assam tea, nutmeg, Serbian plum, lemon peel, clove, mallow flower, and flavoring. <laughs> Her face. <laughs> If you put cream in it, I'm not even trying it. <laughs> I don't like it. I'm giving that a one. I'm definitely getting the plum again. I think the plum is stronger in this one than in that. Well, that one's prune. This one's plum. So it's slightly different. Nah. Is there a cat in the I tomb? think there's a cat back here. Sure you don't want to try it? Yeah, I'm going to go see if there's a cat. Actually, no. That's not cool. That's just cat. A chattel? Okay, I'm back. This one? So you don't like Bergamot either? Yeah. I like this one. I'm going to go again with three and a half. I'm going with the two. <laughs> I'll try this one as a nice tea too. Just don't put it in the picture for me. That's just pure dirt. <laughs> Will you try this <laughs> nice tea? As long as it's not a pitcher full. <laughs> like a jar full? Yeah. Because it'll probably be drank, drank by you anyways. I mean, it's pretty good. So, did I say three and a half again? This one's pretty good. If I had to pick a favorite out of these two, it's going to be the Metropolitan. It's good. Still not as good as Psycho Candy. I love Psycho Candy. I like Breathless the best. Breathless. Right. Does it take your breath away? August Uncommon has a lot of really unique tea blends. And I love, like, their description. Tastes like, feels like. It's interesting. So, that is it for these two tea reviews. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Come back eventually to see when we do these as iced tea reviews. I'm only laughing because of the way you said eventually. Eventually. I have so many teas to do as iced tea. I say we should write like, you know, like Christmas list kinda. I should have a Christmas list tea list and go from top to bottom. So many teas. Starting with our least favorite, going to so our favorites. I think we need to start picking 
a favorite tea of the month, and then at the end of the year, have our favorite teas of the year. Did that make any sense to anyone? So each month out of all the teas we review, we pick our favorite. And then at the end of the year, we decide which one is our favorite favorite? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you later.